What's going on, everybody? It's your boy Maddie with the Bleacher Kings, and I'm coming at you with a quick tutorial for college football revamp. I get a lot of comments, especially on my install video, asking how do I get my game so smooth? And I'm going to show you my settings, man. I'm going to show you the best settings for my PC. I'll give you a little insight in the description. I'll list my PC specs as well. Um, but off the top of my head, I know I got 32 gigabytes of RAM. I only got a 2060. Uh, as a graphics card with six gigabytes of VRAM. And my processor is an AMD Ryzen 7 3700X. I will list those in the description as well. I think a lot of it is dependent on your specs, but nonetheless, I'm gonna show you guys what I use for my settings and it works great, man. My game works great. Sometimes I gotta restart it, but very rarely do I. But yeah, let's get into it. So without further ado, obviously you're gonna open up your RCP uh, RP cs3 launcher again this is obviously for the pc version and you're going to go to config and in config we're just going to go through my settings guys i'm going to show you guys what i use and what works best for me and this gives me the best fps in the game keeps my game running smooth audio running clear fields looking great everything looking great as it possibly can be the cpu tab i don't touch anything in here i never touch anything never have never will Move over to the GPU tab. I put it on Vulkan. Obviously, my graphics card at 2060 with an aspect ratio of 69, auto frame limit, all of this. You guys, you can pause this video and look at it. Um, what I do is I'm I, right here on my resolution is the default to my monitor, 1920 by 1080. Now, I will say this, guys, if you have a little bit of issue, try that, dialing it down a little bit. Try dialing it down a little bit. It might look a little weird. Just try it. You know, that's the biggest thing with this is try different settings. My resolution scale here, I got at 150%. It matches the 1920-1080. Resolution scale at 16 by 16. That's the default. Don't, I don't mess with this setting. Uh, Bilinear, I don't mess with that. The shader mode, all right? This is a big one, um, and I do legacy. And that helps a lot with the skipping and whatnot. Uh, but that's what I do there. And then the additional settings, white color, right color buffers. I believe this is, I don't know if this is checked on default, but make sure this is checked. And uh, make sure you're applying as you go as well so they stick just in case. And then audio, right here audio guys if you're having issues with the audio uh i uh, first off convert to 16 bit obviously up here uh enable buffering that 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 will also help with if your audio is skipping okay i don't use anything in here system leave that all the same uh network don't do anything with that advanced do i do anything in advanced i don't i leave it all the same the emulator leave all this the same as well uh gui and all of that the same guys that's literally all i have i wanted to put this out there for you guys to check it out i like i said i don't do really much with it but that is the stuff i use uh you can pause this video you can go back and i hope that answers any questions if you guys like i said if you're having trouble with the game and if it's skipping and all of that you know check your specs guys it could be it dial some of this stuff down the resolution skills dial it down but yeah that's what i do guys i hope this helped you out if it did let me know in the comments if you if you didn't have any of these and you checked them or if you uh, changed anything and then it worked better for you let me know let me know in the comments guys that's gonna be all i got for this one i'll catch you guys in the next one peace